Massachusetts voters made recreational pot legal last November, and now police departments across the state are making sure that you don't smoke it while you're driving. Northampton police told 22 News reporter Taylor DiCello about a grant they'll use to help curb impaired driving. In Massachusetts, it's legal to smoke pot, but it's still illegal to get high and get behind the wheel. I'm, I'm nervous when people are not all there when they're driving. The Highway Safety Division gave the Northampton Police Department, along with 200 other police stations, a grant to put extra cops on the road to specifically patrol for impaired drivers. The National Highway Division hopes that the extra patrolling will encourage people to use public transportation, ride sharing apps, and designated drivers. At the end of the day, it's all about getting home safely. Traffic safety is always important, and uh, I think, you know, to give people the message that the roads need to be safe, and if you're impaired, you should find another way to get home. Some people told 22 News off camera they don't think additional patrolling will make a difference. There's no perfect method to determine whether someone's actually high like a breathalyzer for alcohol. Northampton Captain John Cartledge says the department has drug recognition experts to do special field sobriety testing. Still, some people say it won't necessarily reduce the number of people who choose to drive high. People already get stopped for drinking all the time, right, but people still do it. In Massachusetts, pot or pot-like drugs were the most prevalent types of drugs found in people killed in car crashes from 2010 to 2014. Taylor DiCello, 22 News.